Hi, welcome uh, back to these tutorials. In this video, we're going to talk a little bit about HTML links. And we use the a tag here to specify a link. So my link we can put as the inner text. And so um, if I were to click on this, I, as long as I supply a location to go to, it would then take me to a location. So href. Um, <clears throat> https colon the backslash www.geogeo.com and so if I were to click this now uh, what's happening is it's saying you can't leave this site <laughs> essentially so um, code pen prevents us from actually going there where you can see it tried to go to google.com um, so I'm just gonna paste that there to make it think it needs to refresh. Uh, maybe this. And it will refresh soon enough. Um, another thing we can do, however, is we can go, there's another attribute that's called target. And if we put blank in this target, <clears throat> so underscore blank, then it will actually open up the link in a new window, so that's pretty handy. Um, and so that is the HTML link attribute. And remember the target, or sorry, link element. And remember the target and href attributes are very important. And again, this is something that you will find yourself using quite a bit. You can even uh, you can put inner HTML, although it's not always as common. You can put inner HTML in here, and it will work as well. And so you can make whole regions of text a link, um, <clears throat> not just one little thing you click, say an entire paragraph could be a link. Um, you can put an image in there, all sorts of things can be made into links.